He won't be competing next week, but nonetheless, he does have 74 fights on his record, 56 victories, 16 losses, and two draws. And there you can see the tail of the tape for this one. This is the first time, I believe, that we've seen Barney Mint here on Thai Fight League. So I'm really interested to see how he performs here tonight. Veteran of the sport, of course, just 32 years of age, taking on the 21-year-old from Uzbekistan. Referee in charge for this one is Pukit Ramprayun. Judge ringside are Tawan Ing Ubon, Prachak Ngao Ngam, and Siprat Chum Suk. Going really hard on the Law Lures now, Aaron. Sorry? Go, I said I was going really hard on the R's. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Here we go, round number one. Now, we've seen a lot of Uzbek fighters compete recently, and my goodness, are they hungry? Yeah, I was about to say the same thing. And some of them have got a lot of talent, but they seem to have this base of either Taekwondo or kickboxing. It is a very unusual style, yeah. but then it's something I tell a lot of people every single week. Like, um, don't try to be like the really experienced Thai fighters. I mean, try try to have that your own style. Yeah. Try, try to have that trick up the back that they don't, they, they don't expect and that's how you're going to win. Of course, what we do usually see, stereotypically from fighters from Uzbekistan, is spinning attacks. A lot of spinning attacks. A right low kick there, perfectly timed. But finally, and down goes Sando. And I don't think he's getting back up. I mean, he took a lot of shots there. And someone in the chat says, oh yeah, this looks like Muay Thai again. Oh, and he's unable to, oh, to oh, get oh, up. And there it is, the first knockout at the new stadium. And it comes from Farnimit. I'll tell you what, that was the very first round. I mean, Farnimit could actually potentially be on the, on the next week's Royal card back in his hometown. That's a good point. It looks tremendous. I think he really wanted that. It came out with a purpose, and of course we know, don't we? You say it week after week. You're trying to make an impression when you come here to Thai Fight League to get that opportunity to potentially compete on the big Thai fight. And that is a great start for the career here on Thai. The highlights. I mean, as we mentioned every single week, we try to find new talent here on Thai Fight League from the provinces mainly. Oh, big knee. Yeah. I mean, he already caught with a one-two combo, put his head down, and that knee basically ended the fight. He yeah. didn't want any more of that. You see that right hand getting through the guard, and that second. And I'll tell you what, Aaron, his head, that's, actually, that's actually what happened to me in my last match oh, in Muay Thai, and that's exactly why I am not stepping back into the ring. Completely understandable. Much Dif safer by behind his death. Difference being, I was actually knocked out. Well, there you can see, through the guard, and then that knee as well. Whether he could have continued or not, he didn't want any more off Barney Mid. All right, short but sweet, Barney Mid gets... The winner by technical knockout. Black corner, Farnie Mitch from Royal!